Hi, I'm Lindley Lund, the Media and Marketing Specialist for Gary County Schools USD 475, and I'm here with our Superintendent, Dr. Reginald Eggleston. Doc, how are you doing? I'm well, Lindley. How are you doing today? I am good, thank you. Um, it's a pretty exciting day for a week for the school district. The Junction City High School is preparing to welcome their students back. It'll be this week, but by the time this runs, students will already be back in the building. Um, this has been a very anticipated event. And so how has preparation gone for the district? Well, everything Everything is going well. We've been working with all of our local officials and local partners in order to make sure that we're prepared to enter the building. As you know, today is the day of orientation for our families and students. It begins at four o'clock and ends at seven. And then the 25th will be the first day that students will actually begin classes. So a lot of energy surrounding the new high school. I know the staff has been out there working hard, getting classrooms prepared. The administrators have been, have been working on schedules, handbooks, and just all of the different resources that everyone needs. So just really an exciting moment to see us uh, make progress and enter into this building, which again, as you stated, has been an anticipated moment for quite some time. Absolutely. And so, you know, once those high schoolers are back in their building, that will have everyone back at school. Um, so what are some of the really main focuses or points that are wanting to take place this school year? Well, of course, our academic achievement is number one. We know that because of COVID-19, we had several students, really several hundred students, who had taken advantage of remote learning. All of these students are now returning to in-person school. So it's gonna take some time for everyone to get adjusted, but I believe that we will be able to put the emphasis where we should, which would be on attendance, student achievement, and just providing the social emotional learning supports that students need in order to be successful this school year. Absolutely. And you know, this is a new school year, so there may be some questions from families. And so where should they go to find answers for this? Well, of course, I encourage parents to always reach out to the school, set up a meeting with teachers, assistant principals, principals, just to find out actually what's taking place in the building and what they should expect. And if it's just general information that they need, they can always go to the school's web page. We've put a great deal of energy and time in trying to make sure that timely, accurate information is out on our web pages, whether it's the district or the individual schools. And I would just encourage parents to take advantage of that information. Absolutely. Well, I think that's all the questions I have. Is there anything else that you would like to mention? Well, I do want to just remind everyone to uh, remain diligent stay safe, uh, communicate well with your teachers and administrators, and if there's anything we can do to support them, please uh, reach out and ask. And uh, we're just excited about a, a new year and to have all of our students and employees back. Uh, these are some good days ahead for USD 475, and I know we're going to do great things this school year. Absolutely. Well, Doc, thank you so much for joining me today. Well, thanks again.